Welcome to the CMS Handy channel. Um, this video is going to be about self-sustaining um, on a homestead farm or just in your backyard in a city or anywhere. Um, we have at my family farm, hobby farm, we have some strawberries, a lot of them as you can tell. And also we had some onions and potatoes that we found. And, but self-sustaining, you never know when you know, you don't, you're broke, you don't have a job, or the power's out, can't go to the store, the store can't sell anything because the power's out, security reasons, or uh, an emergency. Um, you can have tower gardens like these that my sister has, and you can have it in your backyard, your apartment, in the city. Um, those are little sponges or something, the seeds. My nephews just love them. Um, and you can have chickens. Um, with eggs. That's one of our roosters. Um, we're going to pick some eggs up right now. These, we have some buff oranges, these orange chickens. They're good for meat and good layers. And they're, they are pretty docile. They don't, the roosters don't really like to attack kids or anything like that. And we also do have turkeys that we are going to process here at the local FFA in Norco. Um, and this is my water system. Sometimes you gotta have to be handy. Um, to have cleaner water, I decided to have a PVC pipe with about, I think, eight nipples. And you just teach your chickens um, just to peck at this. Take some time to teach them, but make sure you do have an extra bucket of water. But it seems like it's working. Um, some come and go. I just take one chicken and put its beak right next to it for a bit. And, rotate your chickens out to do that that's a little twist knob you can untwist it and clean it out if you need to i don't think you only have to fill this up every other day um clean it i haven't cleaned it yet we'll see how that goes see that water is completely dirty so that's why i caught the, made this pvc pipe you just drill with a 3 8 spit and those twist things you can just get a little red nipples you can get the feet sorry and this is the top I'm just going to take the hose and I'm going to put it down there. I don't have to put it down there all the way and just turn it on. And I think it hold about two gallons. But if you can be self-sustaining, um, you can you can be pretty handy. If you are pretty handy, you can probably do anything. Um, make your life easier. Make sure your property is working. The things that you get are working for you. Um, so it's not as hard working not so stressful but it's nice to have some eggs um, to eat or to hatch we have incubators and some you know money to come in like having chickens uh, you can sell the chickens we sell our chicks for 10 bucks um, depending on the chicken Americanas and the turkeys are different prices we have Americanas uh, I can't remember the breed of the turkey and Buff Warringtons uh, I'm just watering down here. It's just been really hot, like 106 the past few days, just to keep these guys cool. But if you're self-sustaining yourself, and somehow, you know, everyone's different, um, you don't need to go to the store all the time. You're going to provide for yourself. If you know how to provide for yourself, you know, even better. Not a lot of people can do that. Here's a worm wet ranch we have here. The boys just love it. We have some red worms. And um, me chasing dog. I call the rooster. This rooster dog. But if you guys want to um, leave comments below for me. Please do so and subscribe to my channel. Um, hit that little bell to get more notifications. Um, of more videos that come up. And I thank you for watching.